House Republicans have announced former New York Governor Andrew Cuomo will testify before the Oversight Committee about his state's nursing home policies during the early COVID-19 pandemic. Representative Brad Wenstrup, chairman of the Select Subcommittee on the Coronavirus Pandemic, said in a statement, quote, Andrew Cuomo owes answers to the 15,000 families who lost loved ones in New York's nursing homes during the COVID-19 pandemic. On September 10, Americans will have the opportunity to hear directly from the former governor about New York's potentially fatal nursing home policies. Cuomo, who resigned in 2021, had previously testified privately about a March 25, 2020 directive requiring nursing homes to accept COVID-19 positive patients. He claimed he only learned of the order in late April 2020 and blamed it on a staffer. Evidence from Cuomo's impeachment hearing, led by New York Attorney General Leticia James, revealed that up to 9,844 COVID-19 deaths in nursing homes might be linked to this order, and the State Department of Health reportedly underreported these deaths. Cuomo spokesman Rich Azzopardi criticized the subcommittee for targeting New York and Dr. Anthony Fauci while ignoring similar policies in other states and avoiding scrutiny of former President Donald Trump, who led the federal response. Representative Nicole Meliotakis, the only New York delegate on the select subcommittee, expressed frustration that Cuomo has not taken responsibility for the policy. She questioned whether Cuomo was unaware of the issues that local legislators and nursing homes were raising at that time. Wenstrup hopes Cuomo will finally take responsibility and provide honest answers during the upcoming public hearing.